Hey, man, it's me, Jeff, here again for another thread. Another thread. So, yeah, I've been uh, watching things, and I saw this thread pop up, tracked it back to its source. This one actually started on a uh, live stream broadcast from Obscure, uh, Ranking the Obscure, and it was a long show, and Vinyl Richie saw it, and it, he partaked, he took, he part, <laughs> he partook in it, but he also marked in the uh, stream where they were discussing this and so then he turned it into a separate uh, video thread and then i've seen one or two other people jump on it so i thought i would jump on it because it sounds fun threads are fun as i've said because it allows you to use your thinking cap and dig through your collection to show albums that maybe you haven't shown in a long time it just gives you a reason to pull out other albums and and to kind of think about what's in your music collection so the topic this time around is uh drinking it was talking about songs that have some kind of drink in the title. Now, um, you know, it could be any kind of drink. Water was one of the examples. But I ended up getting a bunch of them that have titles that are all basically alcohol, which is how some of the other ones I've seen have done with this. So let's get right into this. I picked 10 songs from bands that have some kind of drinking in the title. So Pat Travers Band, very popular song, Snortin' Whiskey. Um... My band has even discussed possibly playing it. It's one of his more popular songs in certain circles. I've heard covers of it. Anyway, so there you go. Snorting whiskey and drinking the other one, which I won't say. Anyway, uh, Van Halen, Women, Children First, Take Your Whiskey Home. So another one. Um, as you can tell, at least for a handful of these, I basically search my collection for whiskey. Um, take Your Whiskey Home. Carrie Livgren, Carrie Livgren, guitar player from Kansas, went solo. First solo album has a song on here called Whiskey Seed. Um, he had a lot of guests on this album, including one Ronnie James Dio sang a song or two. Anyway, great stuff. Whiskey Seed, and then same exact title, Bride Lift to Die. They have a song on here called Whiskey Seed. Also, talks about the, uh, you know, the, being addicted that to uh, the Whiskey Seed idea, which... Probably how both of them are. All right, Hollywood Vampires, fairly new one here. We got Alice Cooper, Johnny Depp, Steve Perry. We got all kinds of people here, and they have a friend here, a song on here. This is gonna be less of a. This is more of a drinking song, which is kind of how Von Richie posts it. But anyway, he has. A, they have a song in here called "My Dead Drunk Friends," so it's got to do with alcoholism, drinking, and being drunk, and it's a song about my dead drunk friends. On Trouble's album, they have a song, and I am totally dropping the name as I pulled this album out, but it's uh, Arthur Brown's Whiskey Bar. Never stopped to think of that. I wonder if that is the actual Arthur Brown. The, I'm assuming. I wonder if I'm assuming they're talking about Arthur Brown, the artist. That crazy Arthur Brown stuff. Anyway, how about some good old boys from across the pond? Slade with their song, Walking on Water. Running on alcohol. You see that? I think it's like the third song or so. Walking on water, running on alcohol. All right, Ted Nugent Weekend Warriors with his song, Good Friends and a Bottle of Wine. Uh, you have to trust me, I'm not going to see all the songs here. Good Friends and a Bottle of Wine. And then these last ones, I think, are the same. Molly Hatchet, Flirt with Disaster, and their song, Whiskey Man. Yeah, the opening track, Whiskey Man, from this album. And then Riot, Immortal Souls, uh, also has a song, Whiskey Man, on it. I'm about 99.9% .9 sure it's not a cover. I don't think there were any covers on this album. But there you go. So there's 10 songs, drinking, drinking songs. And uh, in this case, alcohol for the majority, um, for all of those. So anyway, great stuff. Uh, jump on board. Have some fun. Do some threads. This is a good one you could try, and I will see you later. Rock on and rock hard.